ready to plant some beans here and show you a quick trick buy yourself some seed inoculant some seed inoculant uh, get the general garden variety type you can get this from Johnny Selected Seeds or you can get it from a variety of places but uh, uh, I use this brand here I guess it's Guard In and so forget the actual company yeah uh, Microbials uh, LLC uh, intxmicrobals.com you can check them out there you can get them from this little pack of seeds here is way more than I need should have brought my scissors out here but uh, uh, the idea is that um, is that these microbes in, uh, live along the root system of the plants of, the, of your beans that's about all we'll need and you put these guys back in the refrigerator try to keep them out of the direct sun right now and I put them in a little bit of water like so and put uh, I typically will put a little bit of um, this is like a tablespoon uh, of water uh, even that's a little too much I, I forget exactly what the instructions say there but use about a teaspoon tablespoon of water uh, and I usually put a small and I mean a very incredibly small drop of either sugar molasses or some corn syrup in it because uh, these bacteria like to feed off the sugars and whatnot and that's that be it and then what I do is come here with my beans I'm not gonna put all the beans in here I'm not sure exactly how many this is gonna hold these are some uh, bush beans provider bush beans that I got from Johnny selected seeds uh, bought a um, forget how many pounds this is, it may be just a pound of them but uh, it's about a thousand seeds or so way more than I'm actually going to use uh, even this season but I'd rather have more than what I need and then we're going to just take them here, just take a couple of handfuls here and you just uh, spoon them around in there now you've coated the the uh, seeds with the uh, bacteria there okay, so now they're inoculated you can see that and once they're done once you've done that we just go plant you know and um, you know the whole point is that uh, beans fertilize themselves at least with nitrogen the atmosphere is 98, well, 78 uh, percent nitrogen. Most of the stuff we, that you see around here is nitrogen. That's why this grass here is green, nitrogen. Normally, you'd have to put nitrogen in there, and you notice you talk in my uh, organic gardening, organic uh, fertilizer videos and stuff that you've seen, many of you've downloaded before. I talk about cottonseed meal as a source of nitrogen. Well, beans provide their own nitrogen. They suck the oxygen air out of the uh, they suck the nitrogen out of the air, store it in the roots underground, and uses it to help uh, themselves grow and produce. And but in order to do that, it needs to have the right microbes. Now these microbes essentially uh, live along the root system of the beans, and will um, grow, multiply, and spread, and uh, help the beans store nitrogen in these little brown nodules and I may see if I can find a picture that I've taken before or inject a little video in here with this to show exactly what they look like and I, and I think I've done a video on YouTube of exactly what the it looks like if you don't have it they won't do it but if you put this inoculant on here the beans will produce far more they'll produce a lot more than what you would expect and that's what they do and so now that that's really well encoded there that's actually way too much water um, but that's okay you know because it doesn't take but a teaspoon of this stuff with a it, you know doesn't take much uh, inoculant at all you saw how very little I put in there but those beans will uh, grow and sprout and so let's just go on over to the garden and plant them 